everyone, Minerva here. Uh, I made this flower following uh, Josie Guido's instructions. And I posted it in the International Crafters uh, group in Facebook and in the, in the page. And she uh, she asked me to show show her how I did it. And I what I actually did I followed her instructions and uh, but instead of uh, going around and around because that didn't work for me it would come come out too tight I tried it with uh, a needle and thread so then I decided to just gather it. So I gathered it and I glued it onto a one inch circle and there I uh, used hot glue and I pushed it into shape. And in this flower also it's kind of hard to see the little, uh, like the sequins and things. It's a little, you can see them but like on when it folds it will hide the, like this part here it has these sequins but you can't hardly see them so that's what I did I just gathered it and then instead of leaving it open like a gathered flower would be I just pushed it push it pushed it towards the center and glued it onto the one inch circle. That's how it came. Oh, oh there it went. <laughs> That's how it, uh, it looks like that. You can see a little bit of the micro beads there. So that's what I did, Josie. And as you can hear, there's some construction going on and kind of hard to make a video. So again, I repeat, I just uh, did everything you did except that uh, at the end I just gathered it and then I pulled it in together and I glued it onto a uh, one inch circle and I held it there so that it would keep that shape. So thank you for the, uh, the inspiration to make this flower. I really like it. I didn't put any lace on it, I forgot. Let me see if I have enough. Maybe I'll do another one. I think I have enough. And I'll just, you know, without sound or anything, just fast forward it. I don't know. But that's what I did. So thanks for watching and I hope you have a nice day, a nice weekend. It's Thursday today and uh, uh, again, thanks for watching. Bye.